Hey, it's AAA, and welcome to Slime Rancher. Oh, I've missed this game so much. It's been so long. And I decided to do a fresh start. I am restarting my Slime Rancher adventure because I, I messed up pretty badly first time. Not gonna lie. I goofed it up big time. Well, oh, come back here, pink. Pink slime, get here. Thank you. I, I goofed it up pretty bad. I'm, I'm determined to make up for it, though. I skipped the beginning, or most of the, as much of the tutorial as it would let me. But this is a new world. This is a new Slime Rancher adventure. Before you ask, no, I do not have the Pirate DLC pack for X, the, uh, Xbox exclusive DLC pack. So no piratey slimes will be in this adventure, I regret to say. Maybe at some point I'll wrangle enough, enough plorts real life plort money to do that but that is to be seen there we go that about covers the basics yay since i've done this episode one kind of grind before i'm gonna probably do like the first 25 to 30 minutes of the game or so and just edit it down into a much more digestible format just kind of enjoy this and i will be streaming this game as well uh, when you're seeing this i plan on streaming it tomorrow in fact uh, just doing some busy work, getting some new bucks and stuff. So, if you have not followed me on Mixer, be sure to do so. That should be down in the description and on my channel page. And I will be streaming some Slime Rancher there tomorrow. So, without further ado, uh, let's get into it. And here is one of the HDEX's things. Hello, Beatrix. The name's Hobson Twig Twilgil... Twilgil... Twilgers. Rancher, explorer, and the former owner of this here ranch you now call your own. Pleased to meet your acquaintance. I was a rancher like you for many years. For more years than I can remember and felt there was one last adventure left in me, so I've set off to find just that. But before I go, I'm taking one last tour around this here land I love, so keep your peepers peeled for more notes like these. If you want to hear what an old coot has to say every now and then, be talking to you, H. So that's H. He leaves little dexes around that give you, like, information about different areas and tips and stuff. Kind of cool. Oh, it's offline. Day one, that makes sense. So let's go on an adventure. Do -do 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 -do. I'm now going to cut back on picking up the pink slimes, and I'm going to focus on picking up the plorts. I've got, like, 20-some-odd slimes already. So, I just want the plorts, which is just literally money. And I know I should carry around food with me in case I find, like, a, a lucky or golden slime or something along those lines. Hey, Q-berries. I love Q-berries. They are one of my favorite thing, one of my favorite food types in a Slime Rancher. If not my favorite. Then again, I do really like the lime mango things. Those are pretty cool. Um... Are you gonna... No, you're not gonna eat the carrots? Okay. Fair enough. Hey, rock slime. Yoink. Oh my gosh. Is that... That's a golden plort episode one. What? Um, I just got the rarest plort in the game on episode one. What the what? <laughs> How? Why? I don't need, like a phantom gold slime just like poofed and gave me a golden plort. I am so perplexed, but I don't even care. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Oh, I didn't read his decks. I should probably do that. This entire cave system was sealed off from a cave-in when I first discovered it. Maybe that's why the little, why the fellows up here are so grumpy. You haven't had a bite in a long time. In any case, don't let that long-awaited bite come from your own rump. Bring some food to calm them down. Oh, my Largo. Yeah, I just launched a Largo into space. Hello. You were the map, I believe. Yes, it's the map. Man, this is a gorgeous map, may I just say. It's way bigger than I remember it being as well. Hello. Just chilling here. Doesn't have a care in the world. Oh, hi. Bye. That Gordo wanted to give me a hug, but I didn't want his hug. His hug hurt. 
He's sharp and spiky. Alright, let's see how much we can get. How much are gold ports right now? 283. Should I save the gold port? I feel like I should. I feel like I should save the gold port, at least for now. Until they're, like, really expensive. But I can't afford a silo to keep it in. And I know they despawn, or I'm almost certain they do. And, let's see, here's a port over here. There's a chicken over here. Hello, Mr. I know they're not chickens, aren't they? They're like hen hens. Thank you. I really like that thing on the top right. Like, you don't have to pick it up to see what it is. Like, you can, and you probably should. Also, you know what? Just because I am going to throw the gold plort in, we're going to get more over time. But we now have $645. We are a rich rancher. <laughs> Very early on. We can afford another corral for our rock slime boy. Grab some hen hens. Boy, boy. There you are. Hi. Let's see. You're a veggie. So I'll throw the hens in here. I will end up crossbreeding these two. Like, these guys will become pinks. Pink. Blah, 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 blah. I can speak. Uh, they'll end up being pink rocks. And. Oh, here's some phosphors. I like phosphors. Hey, buddies. Yoink, yoink, yoink. I'm grabbing these carrots because I'll feed them to the rocks. How much is a solar shield? 425. It'll protect phosphors. If I wanted a phosphor, let's see, phosphor fruit, then these guys would out, eat everything except for meat. That's really tempting. I can almost afford it as well. I don't know. I'll have to think about that. Then again, I was told that I should just have breed everything with pinks in the early game. And this is very much early game, so you know what? Gordo fi, mister. I'll turn in the phosphor plorts. I'll wait until I have that little area behind us unlocked. Oh, I bounced it off the wall. It was like a bottle flip, except it hit me in the face. Like my real life bottle flips. What I should do is realistically do where is it? Garden, here we go. I should garden cuberries. Because that is one thing is favorite fruits are a th favorite foods are a thing that I should take advantage of. Not yet, but I'd like to have... I do eventually want to have one of the areas just silos full of stuff. And it's not just because I'm a hoarder. <laughs> I just feel like it'd be a useful thing. Uh, why did these pogo fruits not get consumed? Oh! <laughs> I accidentally hit the phosphor in the face so hard it flew. I'm sorry, bud. That was totally an accident. Maybe. Probably. There we go. I'm making money, but I'm also burning through it as fast as I'm making it. It's like real life. Let's take that. Avoid rock gordo and take that. Whoa. Was that? Oh, that's a pink phosphor. Oh, you're so adorable. Just launch you in the sky. Use your wings. Fly away. And I just fell right off an edge. I know I could have saved myself, but then I would have gotten lost, evidently. <gasps> tabbies! 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 Get rid of the one plot phosphor floor, because tabbies are everywhere. And I'm a tabbies. And I don't care. Wait a minute, is that... What are you? You're a stony hen. I know you're the favorite food of Tabby, so what I should do... Come with me if you want to live. Well, you won't live. Your ancestors will live. Well, you won't live. You will live, your ancestors won't. Let's read this. I had a great big tree like this one here, along the edge of my property back on Earth. It had been there before anyone could remember. It survived all kinds of change around it, and then one day I began to notice it was dying. It wasn't anything unnatural, with just its time, I suppose. Then I realized that if I didn't do something, I'd end up like that tree. I'd spend my whole life in the same place. And then he bought for a ticket for the 4-4 range the very next day. That's really depressing. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm gonna end up like that tree and die. This is supposed to be a happy game. What happened? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> yeah, Tabby Gordo. 
Yeah, it is its favorite food. I was right. Treasure pods are still locked, obviously. Ow, that hurt. Oh, what? Is there a tar I don't see? Oh! Oh, I'm so sorry! Oh, I accidentally knocked the... I accidentally knocked the scared Gordo into the water. You can fly away. Um... Mr. Phosphor? What? Why are you attacking the... The carrots? You don't eat carrots, friend. You're a fruititarian. That's weird. You, on the other hand, eat all the things. All the things. It's like all your plorts, thank you. Plorts are really weird if you think about it. So I try not to think about it. Because they're basically crystallized rot uh, slime turds. Granite real life slime does crystallize in those kind of segments. And it's pretty looking. But that doesn't make it any less gross in concept. <laughs> I'll just throw that out there. Here we go. You. Yeah, you'll eat that. I'll just shoot that in there and shoot that in there while I do this. So those, since there aren't two types in there, they should never become tars, theoretically. Oh, of course, now the gold plorts are worth an extra 30. Some odd. That's just my luck, is it not? <laughs> These are growing away. Those are really cool looking. It does look like Minecraft, and that's totally not the reason I got them. It's totally the reason I got them. At this point, it's not even worth feeding these guys. I'm sorry. It's not worth feeding you. Because you were literally less efficient in every way than these guys. I'm sorry, friends. I will still treat you well, and I will still love you. But you are useless to me now. And also, you're much less adorable than these guys. Although, I do need a collector. Ah! No! No tar making for you today, good sir. Or you. Get back here. Bad kitty. Oh, and bad kitty flew. See, now I'm starting to think that, like, high walls, kind of a priority. <laughs> you guys are getting transferred. Oh, hi. Ah! Stop this. <laughs> getting transferred. Thank you. And I will ceremonially launch the remaining pink slimes off the edge. Because I don't want to have too many. I should probably figure out exactly how many are in there. That would be smart. Let's see. So I want... How many plorts are on the ground? Alrighty. So let's put in one. No, that's not what I meant to do. That's a tabby plort. That could have created a slime. One, two, three. Okay, that should be good. Now, I will ritually launch the remaining pinks off the edge. Hey, achievement unlocked. Transplorter. I think that's a pretty good way to end off this episode. And I got an Xbox achievement. Transplorter. Sell 500 plorts at the port market. Yay. I think that's a pretty good way to end off episode one thank you very much for tuning in if you enjoyed be sure to pull that like button subscribe for more epically awesome content and these adorable little tabby snacks <laughs> thanks for watching other than that peace out guys